Welcome back to my channel. My name is Yvette and in this channel we talk about anything that is lifestyle, beauty, travel, and anything in between. Once again, in today's episode, how I spend my coins. Another Amazon situation. Another wig from Amazon. So, first of all, this one is actually um, from AliExpress. This one is human hair. The ones that I'm gonna review today and talk to you guys about is similar to this, but it's synthetic. Uh, but yeah, this one I've had for maybe two years now. She holds up pretty well. I have washed her. I have worn her so many times. You know, it is, and I wore her glueless. Nothing's glue. I just have the combs adjusted. So this one is just like a good wig that I got from AliExpress. But nonetheless, let's talk about this this star of the show today. So this is her right there. She's from the Sensational once again. Sensational has me on a chokehold. Sponsor your girl. Come on, sponsor your girl because you're doing it right to be synthetic. So she's from the Butter Lace Collection. It is a bob. It is an HD lace once again. We're gonna try to wear her uh, glueless. Um, she's like another biological yeah, no, that I try to stick to my blonde caramel gold situations. I don't... You hear that? Luna's on drugs. I don't tend to wear dark wigs anymore. I don't know, for some reason, I just, I don't think they look good on me. But we're gonna venture out eventually. But nonetheless, like I said before, she is called, does she have a name? No, she's just Unit 37, Biolash Gold. And yeah, let's just go ahead and open her up and see what she, what was she doing? What was she gonna do for us tonight? Oh my goodness. Okay. hardest time trying to get her out of this plastic and we don't want to damage the plastic because she's going right back in there right oh my god you see that one in the back that's the one that I reviewed last all right so that's her right there and all the colors. I don't know why they just... Okay, so this is her out of the package. So she's darker. She's a darker um, base with some like blonde highlights. She's like the crinkly natural blowout this is what she is given in the front 
she has baby hair. It is the transparent lace. You see that? Very nice for a synthetic wig. Um, once again, she's a tea part. And she has the two adjustable combs on the side. Then she has the adjustable straps and then the comb in the back. And um, she's like 12 inches. She appears to be like 12 inches. Yeah, I don't see how many inches ever, but yeah, look at that. She looks like you just had, you know, your natural hair and you went to the salon and you know, you went and got a blowout at a Dominican salon with a nice, you know, and she looks nice. She's very cute. Oh, wow. I'm impressed. Very soft, not tangled at all. She's a beauty, you guys. She is a beauty. Let's see. Let's let me take this one off and then let's see what happens. All right. This is what we're working with. For those of you that don't know, I have a very short pixie cut. Pretty much white hair. Um, that needs to get dyed soon. Just gonna put a little bit of um powder foundation like this one already had some because of the way that I was wearing. Pajama pants. Because y'all know I just came from work, right? Before I forget, let me put some here because with my last wig review, I totally did not do it. And then I, was, I wasn't regretting it. <gasps> I just broke this crap. So I'm pretty much gonna put a little bit of foundation powder on the parting. And a little bit like in the... Why did you break? I'm going to move the combs. They are, yeah, I'm, I'm lying. I'm lying. Because if I don't, then she's gonna be loose and all that. But yeah, she looks like natural hair that has been blow out by like a good Dominican, you know, hairstylist. Those that. So once again, I'm adjusting it closer to the back home. Sorry, you guys can probably see. I'm not wearing the mic today. How, how are we? I um, mean, you know, are we listening? Oh, is it okay? Uh, feedback, please. <laughs> um, the mic needed like a buffer. I'm testing things out as we go. This is trial and error. But in your feedback. Like one person said that, um, oh my God, I was so embarrassed that she hated the sound of my bangles and I can't take these shits off. They're like, they're for life. I mean, I could, but it's so hard to take them off. Anyways, feedback please, let me know. Is the sound okay? Is the lighting okay? What are we doing? <laughs> so. <laughs> oh my God. Very voluminous to be 
She's cute though. <laughs> Sensational. You just you, you just do it right every time. You just do it right every time. Can we actually see? Let me see. Okay. Well, I I think I put her on too tight with the straps, but can you see? The scalp. Can you see how the lace is even blending in my forehead? You know, she got baby hairs. Let me turn around. She really looks like I just went to the salon. <laughs> Don't mind me. Oh my gosh, she looks good. She looks really good. Oh, we is gonna look fly tomorrow for work. We is gonna look fly tomorrow for work. And I don't know, me personally, I do not like my roots to be like really flat. I like a little bit of volume on my roots. Oh my gosh, she's like the perfect, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, if they have her in black, you know we're getting a we're getting a hair in black. So let me take her off, cut the lace, and then just do the whole glueless install. Unfortunately, it's nighttime, so we're not gonna be able to go outside. But the next day, tomorrow, when I get dressed for work, I'll be able to do that. So for those of you that don't know, so I'm gonna cut really close to the hairline as close as I can I'm gonna use this type of scissors and I am going to do and that's all I do I sometimes hairspray them if I am going out or something like to the club what the hell much cutting so yeah so I'm just cutting close as close as I can I need to focus because I'm um, getting so yes so she comes you know, the regular 1B, the mocha, the caramel, the chunky blonde highlights, um, T27, T30, Balaka 1B is a cute option because I don't have a bob that, a black bob with a middle part. My black bob is human hair, but she has bangs. And she's about 12 inches too. Guys, I'm doing a crappy job today. Like, what the hell? Um, once again, inexpensive. Maybe fifty dollars. My wigs are my synthetic wigs are mostly like fifty dollars. So that's what we did. We cut all the lace. <laughs> so I think I tightened this. Much, but we're just gonna wait. What the hell's this? This is 
weird. I don't want to brush her because I don't want her to lose her pattern. Where did this come from? I know it was inside the wig, but this is just really odd. Ay, Dios mío. Like, yeah, but you see how so it is a very voluminous bob, you know, nothing like straight, whatever. It is a very voluminous bob. Um, actually, oh, uh, yeah, she's gonna be like. Yeah, no, I do nothing to the baby hairs. I leave things the way they are. Yo, I literally just I'm like a child. I don't know, I like my roots to be puffy, but you saw that once you do that, I mean, the hair becomes a little shinier, a little silkier, but it would work if that's your preference, that's your, that's your style. Personally, I think this would be just Really blonde, like caramel. Yeah. Ooh. She's a keeper. She's a winner. She is going places with me. We are going to take her out tomorrow. We are going to work. Um, yeah. Once again, I mean, the highlights are usually so nicely placed. Um, Sensation, it does a really good job, and uh, look at that. Yeah, I might have to like move her down or finish that part right there. If we're gonna keep on doing that, but yeah, and I don't do do hairspray. I don't do nothing else. I pretty much just leave it as is. Um, Okay, Miss Amores, that's gonna be the end of this uh, video. I really like her. I think she's a quick fix, you know what I mean? Uh, short transitioning into the fall. She's not shiny at all. She is, like, look, 
look at this, just look at this. Very nice, very nice hair. Uh, very thick hair. Not thin at all, you know what I mean? The wig itself is very full. Um, and yeah, I think she, I think she looks really, really good. I think she looks really, really good. Um, even in the model, do you see she is, um, her hair is very vol voluminous too. It's not like sitting flat, not like the one I had on before. Um, so I'll have all the details down below. When again, once again, from Amazon, my coins for now. Investing for now. The dividends are coming my way. Um, so yeah. So that's gonna be the end for today. Tomorrow morning, I'll go out to work and I'll take some pictures and you know outside on my way to work, and then we'll see how how she gets in in, in the daylight. But for tonight, that's it. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It just helps you grow out. Um, I'll have another wig review coming up. In my vlog, I showed you guys how to curl that one. In my most recent vlog, I show you how I curl that one. I Googled it, I searched YouTube. I did, of course, the hot water method with the uh, flexi rod. Perfection. Them curls. The ends of the hair, and it is from Sensational as well. So ten out of ten, ten out of ten so, so far uh, from Sensational. I don't remember which brand is the one that I have reviewing up, and this one's a dark color. Uh, next one that I'm gonna review. But anyways, amazing, so pretty, so beautiful. I like her. I like her a lot. So that's the end of the video, Miss Amores. Everyone take care. Have a great night, day, morning. Whenever you watch my video, please like. Please subscribe. Help you girl out. And I'll see you in my next one. All right, you guys. So this is the way outside. This is how the middle part is looking outside. Like once again, it's glueless. Like I have my wig cap on and that's about it. So that's all that's going on. So yeah, you see the color. Just very, the texture. Can you guys get a plum? This morning I did put a little bit of the hat comb. Um, you know? I don't know, when I woke up this morning I was like, ah, oh, this is a little too voluminous for my liking. But this is what she's looking like. It got a little bit of shine once you put the hat comb. And it kind of like flattens out. It becomes more silky than yaki. That's the word. More silky than yaki. But nonetheless, she's cute. She's cute. We're going to work her all day to work. She got to be like yeah, 14 inches maybe. Yeah. And we'll see. Very light. It's a lot of hair, but it's very light. They're picking up the trash. Struggles. Alright, I'm gonna take some pictures and we'll see the final results. <laughs>